hi guys welcome back to my channel it's been a while that i haven't uploaded anything here well that is because i've been busy preparing to be a mother tribute to that i want to bring you guys along with me on what i've been busy on so today's video will be about what your newborn needs basically what are the essential things you need to buy for your newborn let's get started as i will explain to you one by one on the items you need only the basic one so you won't miss out on anything Okay, so first you need our baby's clothes. There's a lot of types out there. So one I'm showing you right now is bodysuits with no sleeves and no pants. Suitable for daily wear and suitable for a weather like here in Malaysia, very hot summer weather. Bear in your mind, get your get newborn size, zero to three months and three to six months. Of course, uh, being the least is newborn next type will be bodysuit as well with short sleeve and no pants so this one i'm getting few pieces as well just to keep the options open so as you can see i have about three to four pieces all right third types of baby clothes will be bodysuits with long sleeves and no pants also to keep the options open this one i bought around five to six pieces of different different designs from a newborn to three to six months the fourth types of baby clothes is bodysuits with long sleeves and three quarter pants so as you can see the fabric here is a bit warm i just want to keep the options open again so um to the baby if it's if the weather is quite cold i can put this on to the baby the fifth types of baby clothes that I bought is short sleeve and short pants. So this one, um, I bought about four pieces with uh, very fancy designs because I just want to keep the options open. So these I bought, I didn't buy in newborn. I just bought three to six months just in case if he turns out to be a big baby. So I have options as well. Alright, so this will be the last type that I bought for my newborn. It's called Baby Pyjamas or Rompers. It's actually for nightwear or sleeping wear. It has mittens and socks sewn together with the, um, with the uh, pyjamas. And it's warm and uh, as you can see, it has zip because at night it's, it's going to be really easy for you to change diapers. You just unzip it and then um, take out his um legs and you know and then you can change the diapers without even pulling the um the bodysuits from top part so it will be easier for you and your husband so these are the baby clothes that you need you can get them at, at mother care at happy kiddo at cotton on kids at h&m at uniqlo they have a lot of options the other things that you need to buy to uh, accessorize your newborn which is mittens so mittens you can get from newborn zero to three months and three to six months as well um, you can get different different designs it's up to you and these are actually good to cover their hands or their nails from scratching their face that you need to purchase is socks socks is also important um, to actually keep them warm so you can also buy from newborns your three months and three to six months because socks is quite elastic so you don't have to worry you can wear it on a long-term basis I also bought like a tight leggings for the baby to be covered in case if they are wearing their bodysuits without pants and it's quite cold so you can put that on um, to the baby next is their shoes this is actually not really an essentials but i just want to have um, just in case if i want him to be a little bit more fancy so i bought him three pairs of newborn shoes which is elastic so i can use it in a long-term basis so i have three designs it's up to you what color you want it's your own preferences so i bought this just to complement the outfit that i already bought it's not really a need yeah so Okay, next is baby hats. So I go ahead and bought zero to three months, newborn and three to six months. So just keep the options open. I have few designs here, as you can see. Um, so this is to keep them warm. Next is baby bibs. So this one uh, is like a napkin where you can actually hang around their neck 
to keep them uh, dry because sometimes baby drool so this is essential for you to keep them um, hygienic okay next is swaddle swaddle is important because swaddling can help to make your baby feel secure and less likely to be disturbed by jerks he does in his sleep so get about a dozen of swaddle so that you can change more frequently okay next will be barut i don't know the terms in english but it's actually to protect the baby's stomach so that uh tak masuk angin so there's no wind going inside a uh, baby's body so as you can see here i bought two types one is the um the one with designs and one with plain so you can actually buy in any designs you want get at least a dozen or two because this will be frequently changed to your babies sometimes it uh it touches the baby's pool so we just constantly need to change it um yeah just by a few another important stuff will be napkins so napkins you might need a lot of this doesn't matter if it's um small or big but of course medium size will be the best like i have now uh, so this acts as many purpose uh, but make sure you have a lot of stock of this okay next is baby pillow baby pillow make sure you choose a soft supporting and breathable pillow like i have one right now this is from clever mama i bought it from mother care it's a little pricey that's because i wanted to invest in this because um baby have a naturally round shaped head so we want to prevent it to being flat because baby skin is very soft so you need to protect it and with this pillow you can prevent the flat head syndrome uh, so get at least uh, one or two okay moving on to the next item which is blanket so i actually bought two for the baby one is from ikea just to keep the baby warm and the other one is the father that bought for the baby he wanted something special for every child Aww. so he bought a special blanket just to welcome our baby which is from rough lauren so yeah pretty special okay moving on uh next will be breast pump i bought uh from hanim uh it's actually from baby expo uh we found it uh, during our tour there in mid valley exhibition I've already taken out from the box it comes together with four uh, free milk storage bottle it's quite easy to use i'll share with you guys in another video if you guys want to see how do i use this breast pump and um yeah even though they gave a free bottle i also um, had the chance to purchase one extra bottle from tommy tp which is from zero months plus so this will be an extra bottle if i ever needed one just in case when we have a bottle we need a bottle cleaner so don't forget to buy this bottle cleaner it has a big brush and a small brush small brush is for the nipple part and big brush for the bottle part so yep this is essential moving on this is a breastfeeding cover so during your breastfeeding in public you can cover yourself with this cloth that are designed um, to help mom to cover uh, during uh, public breastfeeding okay next items are mostly accessories like pacifiers feathers you just need few if you're a minimalist kind of mom you just need like two or three maybe so this one i bought from zero to six months and six to twelve months and tether as you can see i have three currently um yep so uh, alongside i will just purchase more if if needed okay next items will be for the baby's bath time so first i have the powder from johnson's and also the shower top to toe shower from cotton touch johnson's as well and to pair with it uh, is lotion face and body lotion from cotton touch and then i have the baby oil and then uh, the cologne so that the baby smells good and next will be lotion from carry it actually acts as uh, a lotion to prevent mosquito and then minyak yuyi yuyi oil i also have vaselines that actually acts as an epi rash cream uh, to prevent any rashes on the baby's butt 
and then um, next will be cotton bud for baby specially designed for them uh, and then uh, hand sanitizer and uh, cotton balls and cotton pad i have two types i just just in case and then yeah that's pretty much it next is wet wipes this one i got from my friend she actually bought for me a, a carton of it so thank you very much and then newborn diapers buy a small packet because we don't know the baby size yet so don't buy a lot okay and next will be cover to change uh, the baby's diaper so this is quite practical so as you can bring it around uh, this one is from Purin. It has double-sided. It has a plain and a cartoonish one. As you can see, I hate the one with the cartoon. I love the plain one. So, yep. Thank God it can be re it's reversible. Next one will be Baby Bathtub. I actually bought this from Mother Care. It's the brand from Skip Hop. It's called the Moby Smart Sling Tree Stage Top. It actually has a secure seat to help support the infant and I also bought the waterfall bath rinse together it's so cute it's to protect the baby's head so that it's because it's soft so it's 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 quite safe for the baby after shower what do you do you clean your baby you rinse and you just keep them dry so we need a towel guys so um, invest on the towel because it will touch your baby's skin make sure you pick a good quality one so here i have is from clever mama bamboo apron baby bath towel just get like maybe three or four or maybe five uh, just to keep it hygienic and to frequently change it as you shower your baby Next, we move on to two most important detergents that you need to purchase. One is actually a bottle and dish liquid uh, detergents for you to actually wash your baby's bottle, the items, the pacifier, anything related to the baby. Uh, this is chemical free, hence I actually uh, recommend this. I bought this from Mother Care. It's a brand called Aliva Naturals. And next will be detergent to wash your baby's baby's clothes um, it's also chemical free it's from purine this is two in one detergent and softener as well it's important to actually differentiate yours and your baby's uh, detergents because ours are quite high in chemical which we are able to sustain with our body which is a growing growing adult human but for baby they're very sensitive so you need to find something that are chemical free and natural Okay, so um, next you will need a car seat for you to install in the car when you welcome your new baby. And then uh, you will need a stroller as well. These are the two essential for you to mobile with your baby. For baby's grooming, you need a brush, um, a comb and everything. So this is one set from Tommy TP. Uh, the comb is quite, um, the bristle is, is, is not harsh. So make sure you choose the right one. And they have like scissors, they have brushes, they have nail clipper, they have nail filer, they have thermometer and they have even no syringe to protect to actually take out mucus from baby's nose so this is quite ha quite handy so you can get this from Tommy TP next is of course for the mother the mother is important too so you need to take care of yourself after you deliver so these are the postpartum care that you need i have kind batik here uh, at least purchase one dozen because you are you will frequently change as well and then uh, you will need a disposable underwear um, because you will uh, produce a lot of blood after delivery so you don't want to wash all the time so you just throw it away uh, and then maternity pads um, at least get two packs of this size because you will need a lot of them and then nursing bra for you to nurse your baby it's actually quite easy uh, because you just have a clip on to open it and then you have a nipple cream you need to have a nipple cream because you never know you're gonna sore your nipple and then i bought this from um, like our local store which is pati halia uh, it's actually very warm cream uh, so that to prevent from fatigue or numbness and then i also have a i also have a breast pad 
to actually protect your nipples from leaking because usually after delivery you will lick a lot of breast milk so you don't want that to show on your clothes and then i do have this bio oil as well to actually prevent scars to to lighten the scars because when you're pregnant you have stretch marks so you want to lighten it this is quite good this this brand and then next is you need to have a white cloth i bought this from uh, jackal just one meter is enough because later after you uh, delivery you will have the placenta to cut from your body and it needs to be buried um, this usually is done by your husband you wash it first and then they will bury um, anywhere that is um, safe Okay guys, that's the end of the video. Um, thank you so much for watching. Hope it helps. Uh, this is my first experience as well. So apology if uh, there's anything that I missed out. If I do miss out on anything, please, please tell me. Do comment down below. Um, and guys, it's free to subscribe. So uh, I really, really, really appreciate it. If you can subscribe to me, just click the red button button and i would really 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 appreciate it thank you so much for watching and subscribe to me